Hello everyone and welcome! Some of you may know about Riot's Thunderdome, but for those of you who don't, the Thunderdome is an internal event which any rioter can join in order to finish a gaming project in 48 hours. In other words, a bunch of rioters get together to make games in only two days. Mostly these games are not for public release. The point of Thunderdome is to challenge rioters and make them realize and improve their skills. They don't have to create a fully fleshed out game, but they should finish some form of a project. Two years ago, Riot released a short video about Thunderdome on their main channel. I'm not entirely sure why it was taken down, but it was probably because it showed some Super Smash Bros footage. And we know that back then Nintendo didn't like their games on YouTube. Now, I was able to find the video through a lot of backtracking, so I'll show you only a small part of it so we don't make anyone mad. So we've got over 380 people participating in, in Thunderdome. It's really about getting teams together to just try kind of moonshot type things. If you're doing Thunderdome with the people that you work with every day, you're doing Thunderdome wrong. The team and I are taking League of Legends characters and we're, uh, we're actually making a fighting game. We're working on a project to basically build some robot minions and have them fight. So we're working on a game called Clash of Fates. Two players playing head-to-head, -head. whoever has the fastest reaction time um, wins out. Luckily this year Riot was able to make a game that could be publicly released. And you can read about the entire creation process on their boards. The link will be below. And since that game was publicly released, that's what I'm going to play now. And we are in. So this is the game that they created this year in about 48 hours. Um, I have not played it and I don't have insanely high expectations because, you know, how much can we actually make in 48 hours? So <laughs> let's see. Uh, Alright, so we got a platformer. We got a... a Alright, so, so I kind of get why they were able to actually create a functional game now because I see that... They just re I can't zoom in, can I? No. They just recreated, uh, not recreated, they actually used Zig's model. Oh, there's an enemy, I should probably blow him up. There's an enemy with a shield, which I blew up as well. Oh, that's a jumping platform. Huh, surprisingly. This actually doesn't handle too badly. But, alright, obviously. <laughs> uh, because they used models that they already had S things are easier however I see I got this thingy uh, however it, it, that's actually awesome that it works exactly the same way as it does in game uh, so I only have his Q and W uh, maybe I'll change I don't know maybe I'll get the E later on however as, as I was saying um, this actually handles quite well. It's not too bad. Why is there? Is that a donut? Right there. Oh, I see a lot of riot, riot-ish um, Easter eggs. Can I? I had to break it, right? Can I get back? Actually, oh, I can. All right. <laughs> I didn't break it entirely. I just found the bug. In case Riot will... I can't probably go down there. In case Riot will want to fix that. Uh, is there an enemy down there? No. What's actually the point of this level? Oh, there's a counter up there. Oh, three enemies to go. I don't wanna die. Do I actually have lives? Lives. That's actually something I probably... I don't see any. So is this permadeath thingy? If I die once, I'm dead. Oh, that's the last one. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Actually, there's a there's a fly in my room. I'm not sure. I hope the mic won't pick that up. <laughs> Actually, hold on. I want to try one thing. Oh. Okay. I'm just like looking. You know what's awesome about this? That when you look at the background, they actually had to make a lot of stuff without reusing models. Like these flames, they did not have in game. Oh, that's awesome. There are physics here. I can... If I throw a bomb... Oh, did I just throw a Poro? If I throw a bomb... 
and I throw another one, they will collide. Hold on, let me try somehow. See? That's awesome! There could be like some really awesome trickery with this. See? However, that fly is actually irritating me. I hope the, I hope the camera <laughs> will not pick that up. Um, however, that's actually amazing that they had to create a lot of models on their own. In 48 hours and the background. Okay, these flames are obviously uh, Brands W only stretched out, I think, I believe. I'm like looking around trying to figure out what assets could they use from the other games. For example, these like, you know, Donkey Kong style or Mario style. Uh, oh, I died. Uh, bridges, this, these pink thingies. Those are not part of ward, wards of or, or anything like that, right? Or like, what did I do? Uh, Thunderdome. Oh, there's even a link to their uh, site. Huh. Alright. Try number two. So, uh, Thunderdome. The fly is actually on the microphone right now. Uh, Thunderdome. The reason why they are creating these games is to experiment, see what they can do. Ooh, that's sneaky. Fire. Will I die because I'm... This is really dangerous. That fly is sitting on the mic. Um, <laughs> God dang it. All right, try number three. Uh, as I was saying before, Thunderdome. They are basically experimenting and trying to figure out what would people like. Because, you know, they are playing the games that they create after they are done with it. I'm not going to go that way because that way sucks. Um, but, for example, in the video that uh, I showed you, you know, just the just the part of it, can I like, yes, I can pump it up. Yeah. Uh, in that video that I showed you, that they took down later, you can see that they uh, worked on a fighter, and because Riot obtained the rise, I I'm not actually sure about that story. I I totally forgot how that story goes. But Riot basically obtained rights to some kind of fighter. So people speculated that they were actually creating a legit fighter. Which is absolutely possible. And because they already have like their beginnings from the... What is going to be sneaky? Is there a fire? Nope. Because they already have all the assets and whatever they created, you know, the, the, the start from the Thunderdome. They can actually make the fighter real. And that's what this is all about. There are eight more enemies? Or is it zero? Is it zero or eight? Oh no, there's a fighter. Ooh, I just realized it in time. Um, they can make it real. So the question is, should they make it real? Because, oh. Oh, okay. Okay. Sorry that I uh, stopped talking, but um, this is um, this is surprisingly really high quality. But again, dang it! Oh, I should probably shoot him. I just noticed there's a massive health bar. Um, where do I shoot him though? Um, they were able to recreate a bunch of. Ah, dang it! Is that his ult or is that his Q? That's what I'm wondering. I'm wondering like all these things while I should probably pay attention to the fight. I think that's his ult. Those fires at the bottom, what are those? What are those? As I was saying, the fire, um... I think that is... Oh, I know what that is. That fire down there. That's Muscle Flesh from uh, Misfortune's Gun. Okay. Okay. That won't hit me. That won't hit me. This will hit me, so I'll jump over it. This suck, though. Oh, do I hit that? Oh, I do. Ha <laughs> ha! Okay. So now I have to survive again. That won't hit me. That will hit me, so I'll jump over that. And I jump down. Okay, I'm gonna be, uh, I'm gonna criticize this game. I hate the jumping. I hate platformers where, 
When you jump, you can't change directions maybe jump. I hate that. So... And I'm not used to it because I recently played a lot of Shovel Knight. And Shovel Knight does not have that. I should probably shoot that. There we go. Alright. Same side again. Ba -ba -da -ba. The other side. Ba -ba -da -ba. The other side. Ba -ba -da -ba. This, uh, this could be legit. Alright. 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 I. Fuck. This could be a legit game, though. This could be absolutely legit game. Which makes me wonder. Couldn't they, every ar arcade year, couldn't they just add in levels? They already have all the assets. They could just make like expansion every year. That would be awesome if they did that. Alright, bump to that. Oh, I have a time limit? Or is that just for score? I hate these thingies that fall from the top because... Uh, I don't have a lot of time to react. Shoop. Boop. Is there one more? I guess one more. That lava. Oh, fuck. I was looking at the background again and I, I, I got caught. God dang it. All right. <sighs> Try number whatever. I don't actually know. I wasn't counting. I hate these. He'll fire it from the top. Beep, 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 boop. I hate those. Beep, 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 beep. Jump over that. Jump over that from the top again. Fucking hate those. Fire. Boop. Perfect. Easy. Uh, top again. I think it's firing at me if I'm not moving. Uh, I jumped into that one. I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. So the fire actually goes up. Try number whatever. All right. This time, I will not change my strategy. Why is he doing those? Yeah, why isn't he doing those instead? Those are way easier. For example, I won't move. Or I won't move. And then they'll fire. There we go. That explosion is six old. When I fire, I should really... I should focus, actually, because every time I talk about that crap, I get hit. But when I fire at his thingy gun, not like now, that explosion is six is old. So they are clever that they, re that they used a lot of those assets that they already had. Oh, it's getting faster, is it? Second one. All right. Oh wait, that was the third one. I did not even realize. Is that it? Is that a hextech chest? Do I get something from hextech chest? Do I get a skin? He got an icon. See his disappointment. He got a lot of icons, that's even worse. I absolutely get his disappointment. Well, it was actually a really good game, surprisingly. That's, I mean, I shouldn't say surprisingly because, uh, you know, I don't want to offend those who made this game, but surprisingly for 48 hours, this was actually really good. Now, I don't know how many people were on that team. Should I just like do Nick? My score will probably suck. Yep. I don't even know what my number was. But. That's it for this game. Oh, I saw the Easter egg. There was a, there was a really quick flash of someone's face. I guess that's one of the developers. But, as I said, uh, I wouldn't be surprised if maybe in the future we could possibly get more of these. Now, most likely not that often. I'm guessing maybe one per every two years or so because I don't think that Riot will pump out a new Thunderdome game every year at least not for the public and you know what this was good and I would love to see expansions if they had the time and if they could 
every year since we always get the arcade thingy when Gamescom is around. They could just, every Gamescom, they could just do an expansion and that would be awesome and I don't have any anything else to say. Uh, if you would like, like to play this game, I will hopefully put the link somewhere. It is on their official uh, board uh, on their site, so you can find it there. And with that, I guess I'll see you in the next video. And as always, thank you for coming again.